We're uh, CDC compliant, six feet. We can take it off. Massimo, we're here at Italia, just west of the Turnpike on Okeechobee in West Palm Beach. Thanks for having us. Glad to have you here. Couple of Boston guys here. Uh, Massimo, his brother-in-law Al. Nice operation. Good family operation. So, beautiful place. How long are you guys here? I know a long time restaurateur. So we've been down here in South Florida for about four years. We have another restaurant in Juno Beach called County Line Pizza. Mm -hmm. And uh, we were looking to expand this past year and we opened up a few months ago down here. Beautiful, great location. A lot of growth out west, Loxahatchee, Wellington, the acres. So uh, uh, look at the activity now, middle of day, lunch, dinner. So uh, down from Boston, a couple years now. And uh, tell us about this uh, little gem you got here. So we just opened up this up a few months ago. It's called Italia. It's our second restaurant, like I said. Um, it's just good homes, like homemade, made to scratch order food. Like, so everything's made to order. The fettuccine Alfredo, the uh, chicken parm. We're not, fr we don't have pre-fried cutlets in the back. Everything's made to order. Everything's made from scratch. Nothing comes out of a uh, freezer. Nothing comes out of a microwave. Nothing comes out of a, like a steam table, really. So we just want to do good food. Nah, you can walk in, tell right off the bat, nice family operation. Interesting, right off the bat there, I see Johnny Walker Black. It's a full service bar. Absolutely. Got everything here. Beautiful booths, table, COVID compliance. How you guys making out? in this new norm right now over the last seven months you know it was a struggle but we're getting there good um you know things are coming back to normal and the restaurant's coming back and we're doing better and better every day love to hear that you know i'm just yeah. happy happy to stay open and Beautiful. happy to grow more good stuff so usually it's a cars and coffee today uh, cars and pizza so and pizza. Uh, you got I got a little Quite a flashy vehicle there. Yeah, I got a little rocket outside. Okay. Of a 2019 BMW X3 M40. Wow, now that's impressive. It's a really good grocery getter. You know, I'm looking forward to, you know, moving up to the M8 CS. Uh -huh. Have the world's fastest delivery vehicle. I don't know how you feel about that. I'm very impressed. You can't go wrong. Anything you get from Bremen, the BMW line's amazing. Al in attendance. I guess he's in the kitchen now. He's in the kitchen now, yeah. Al's got, uh, Al's got, got the 530, a hybrid. Yep, Al's got the 530E hybrid. Okay, it's, and uh, now your dad, Rocco? Rocco's has uh, three, so we've had BMW for a long, long so time. So three generations, so we're uh, brother-in-law's, the father, and a then, variety of uh, Brayman BMWs in the garage. And uh, your dad in the restaurant business back in the day? Or? No, he was actually in the clothing industry. Really? Um, made, you know, uh, bespoke suits, so worked on a few cool guys, a uh, few presidents, a few athletes, a few movie stars. Wow, pretty impressive. I went completely opposite. I couldn't do what he did, uh -huh. so I decided to do it in a different way. <laughs> I'll tell you something, I go back to Boston, usually back there, I'm a New Yorker, but uh, nothing sorry. like... Uh, <laughs> So we get the Yankees, Sox, and the whole rivalry and all that, but, uh, you know, nothing like the North End. No, absolutely not. Uh, great. We're going to head into uh, the kitchen now, see what the boys have uh, prepared for us. That's good. We're back here in the kitchen with my chef Alex. We're going to make some uh, pakiri, chicken broccoli and zidia with garlic, and uh, some meatballs. Let's go. We're going to start with the chicken. We're going to saute that in the pan with some uh, extra virgin olive oil. A little bit of onions, give it some flavor. Bring it on the heat and we gotta cook that. We're gonna drop our broccoli in, we get it fresh every day. We're gonna add a little bit of white wine, give it some uh, flash, bring all those flavors together now. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. We do a little bit of parsley, give it some color, a little bit of oregano too, just to brighten up the dish, give it some, some more oomph. Clear sauce we make in-house. Just to get those everything together now. Yeah, pasta and the broccoli is ready. I'm gonna reduce it and drop it down. Saute it in the pan so all those flavors meld together. It's all about melt, uh, melting the pasta and the sauce together. If you're just putting sauce on top, you're not getting the full flavors out of all the pastas and stuff like that. Ready to plate. And a little kiss of extra virgin olive oil at the end. Chicken, broccoli, and ziti. There we are. Wow. We got the chicken, broccoli, and ziti. 
with uh, garlic and oil. How about that? Massimo, Al in the kitchen, back here, Italia. Beautiful wall of family photos. I'm a happy customer here. It's Club Bremen Spotlight. Nothing like Bremen Motor Cars. You're not going to see Herb Chambers doing anything like this up in Boston. Great Boston guys. Family operation. You're going to love it. I'm going to love it. And uh, let's dig in. Wow. Twist shot here. Love it. Thank you. Love it. Great. Italia. We're just west of the Turnpike on Okeechobee. West Palm Beach. Family owned and operated. Love these guys from Boston. It's my new home. It's going to be yours too. See you next time on Brayman Spotlight. Thanks again. Thanks, Bob.